Good morning. I would like to call to order the meeting of Wednesday, April 28th, as the Office of City Commissioners Board of Election. Uh, we will begin with any uh, in-person public comment. Commenters shall state where they live, or if they are not a resident of Philadelphia, if they are a Philadelphia taxpayer. Public comment is not an opportunity for dialogue or Q and A. It is public comment, a chance for you to tell us what you think. Each speaker shall have two minutes. However, I may extend this time at my discretion. All public comments must be relevant or germane to your business. Finally, it is my responsibility to preserve the order and the quorum of the meetings, and as such, profane, slanderous, discriminatory, or personal attacks will not be tolerated. Anyone wishing to offer public comment at this time, please step forward. Anyone here for uh, polling place changes, I would ask that you please hold your comment until that portion of the meeting. If there's anybody here uh, for public comment, please step forward. State your name for the record. Good morning, my name is Rich Garella. I'm a resident and taxpayer of Philadelphia. I'm with Protect Our Vote Philly. I wanted to ask you today about the um, practice of this board to introduce motions that the public has never been advised on. We believe this deprives the public of the reasonable opportunity to comment on official actions that the Sunshine Act guarantees in Section 710.1. Our suggestion is to do as many other boards and agencies do, which is simply to publish an agenda about 24 hours in advance, telling the public which motions are likely to be deliberated and voted on in the upcoming meeting. Otherwise, you have a public comment period at the beginning of a meeting, then you cut off public comment, and then you introduce a motion on a topic that the public has never heard. That's not a reasonable opportunity. We'd be happy to work with you to come up with a an easy and effective way to do this. The second point I'd like to make, which is closely related, is that I have here a couple of public comments that were submitted by email. And we'd like to urge the board to change its practice of merely announcing whether emailed comments came in, and actually then do what other boards and agencies do, which is to uh, read out those public comments, or at least summarize them, maybe answer points that they raised if, uh, if possible. Otherwise these, public, otherwise, these comments are not really truly public. And then they should also be appended to the transcripts that are posted so that the public can see them. So that they don't just kind of you know, disappear into a hole and they're never seen again, which is very discouraging for the public. So if you would consider uh, making these changes hopefully by uh, motion of the board, so that we know that it will consistently happen, it would be true. That's fine. Thank you. Thank you. We will now uh, ask uh, Commissioner Sevier for a report from the Secretary regarding email public comment. Good morning. Good morning, Commissioner. All comments that were emailed by non for the Commissioner commissioners and the deputy attending them have been provided to each commissioner at the beginning of the week and are available at the public comment table. We received two comments from Ms. Arella and Kevin Goldblatt. I have received them and thanks for the meeting to them. I've also reviewed them and agreed that they should be looked at. I have also reviewed it. I ask that it please move it into the record. I just wanted to address um, two things that have come up. Uh, one is that, yeah, our public uh, email comments are uh, posted with the transcripts. And I also wanted to address something that came up on social media, and as well as that it was um, the subject of one of our public comments. We have already began the transition of our website to a .gov domain. We'd like to thank you for bringing this to our attention, but please know it is something that we are already working on, 
and it should be completed uh, within, the, within the year, along with other uh, website updates. We will now move to old business uh, with a report from our executive director, Joe Lynch. Morning, Richard. Good morning, Joe. Morning, Joe. Today's Sunshine Report, we are currently accepting absentee and mail-in ballot applications online at rosepa.com or by paper application. Absentee and mail-in ballot applications must be received by May 11th. The County Board of Elections Office at City Hall Room 140 is open for walk-in voting. Our hours are Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. through Election Day. For those interested, please enter City Hall through the South Gate to the cross from the Ritz Carlton Hotel. Voters that need a replacement ballot can order one at, the, at ballotform.philadelphiavotes.com or pick up a replacement ballot at our City Hall office. As of yesterday, we have approved 73,841 absentee and mail-in applications for a primary. Of those, 57,420 are paper applications and 16,421 are electronic applications. We have produced and sent 72,850 absentee and mail-in ballots so far. Today is the last day to petition the court, the court of common pleas for a court appointment to an election board agency. Our vote by mail unit, since April 19th, we have received 7,075 7, ballots back. That includes mail, drop boxes, and satellite office at room 142 to date. Room 142 has also received 10 military and absentee um, overseas ballots. Um, pick up, we, we made an appointment, we made a, we went to the post office in, in our area where, where the warehouse is and we're pick, doing, we're actually picking up the ballots every day at 8 a.m. in the morning, every, every day, Monday through Saturday. The election board unit has confirmed 5,587 poll workers to date. And, and since the last report, they have trained 328 people that attended, that attended the classes. Our voter registration unit for the election cycle, we processed 111,847 voter registrations, and out of that, 8,496 were paid. That's all I have for you. Thank you. We will now proceed to the Board of Business with polling place changes and our Assistant Administrator, Joyce Roll. Good morning, Commissioners. Good morning, Joyce. Good morning, Joyce. Relocation proposals for hearings on April 28th. These have been confirmed by the uh, board leaders, and there's, there's no, there, excuse me, they, they're, they accept it. Okay. Ward 2, Division 2, Ward 2, Division 3, Saigon Maxim Restaurant at 612 Washington Avenue has been relocated to Gloria Dale Sweet's Church, 916 South Swanson Street. Ward 2, Division 4, Saigon Maxim Restaurant, 612 Washington Avenue. Joyce, what are you Oh, I'm sorry. Hold up. Oh. So, I know we have a we have a pretty good list to get through, but as required, we're going to have to uh, do, okay. a, do it so after each after each change. Okay. So if you can uh, just please start over with uh, two two. Okay, sure. Thank you. Two two and two three. Saigon Maxim Restaurant, six twelve Washington Avenue, has been relocated to Gloria Day Old Sweets Church, nine sixteen South Swanson Street. And the reason for the move was. I vote to approve this change. I vote uh, Once again, I have to object to this violation of Sunshine Act 710.1. The public did not have reasonable opportunity to comment on these motions. I know that you did Ms. mention Carella? that there would be votes on polling place changes, but you didn't list these polling place changes online anywhere where the public could see them. So Mr. Morello, we check with the law department and we are meeting all of our notification requirements. But if you plan on still objecting, I ask that you would consider doing one blanket objection instead of interrupting each vote. That's right. 
this blanket objection will cover all the votes. Thank you. I will once again uh, say that uh, I vote in favor of the polling place change for Ward 2, Division 2 and 3 that are moving from Saigon Lines to Gloria Day, Old Sweet Church. Uh, the reason for this move is that there was a refusal at Saigon Max. The second? Second. All in favor? Aye. Ward 2, Divisions 2 and 3, approved to move to Gloria Day, Old Sweet Church. Proceed, please. Ward 2, Division 4, Saigon Max Restaurant, 612 Washington Avenue, being relocated to Santor Library, 928 South 7th Street. Reason refusal. I vote to approve. Vote to approve. Commissioner Sevier? Thank you. Proceed, Joyce. Ward 2, Division 12, Saigon Maxim Restaurant, 612 Washington Avenue, relocated to the Activity Center at the Tower, 1021 South Court. Reason being refusal. I vote to approve. 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 Proceed. Ward 2, Division 13, Saigon Maxim Restaurant, 612 Washington Avenue, relocated to Settlement Music School, Curtis, 416 Queen Street. Reason being refusal. I approve. 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 Proceed, Joyce. Ward 3, Division 19, Sharon Baptist Church, Community Center, 5845 Catherine Street, relocated to Anderson School, 1034 South 60th Street. Reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Proceed. Uh, Ward 10, Division 23, Congregation Temple, Bethel, 7350 Dover Street, relocated to Science Recreation Center, 7200 Wollston Avenue. Reason being, refusal. I vote to approve. 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 Proceed. Ward 12, Division 13, Elders Place, 53 East Wilson Street. Relocated to Mastery Worcester Charter School, 67 East Springhurst Street. Reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Proceed. Ward 22, Division 4, Germantown Jewish Center, 400 West Ellis Street. Relocating to Commodore Barry Irish Center, 6815 Emblem Street. Relocated. Reason being refusal. Vote to approve. Approved. Proceed. Ward 25, Division 1, River Wards Cafe, 3118 Richmond Street, relocated to Tomaszewski Funeral Home, 2728 East Allegheny Avenue. Reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approved. Approved. All right. Ward 25, Division 3, Ward 25, Division 8, the Coe Hosnick Recreation Center, 2901 Cedar Street. Relocating to Tomaszewski Funeral Home, 2728 East Allegheny Avenue. Reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay. Ward 28, Division 8, New Life Baptist Church, 2450 West Sargent Street. Relocating to Love Zion Baptist Church, 2521 North 23rd. Reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay. Ward 30, Division 8, Ward 30, Division 16, Philadelphia School, 2501 Lombard Street, relocated to the Balkan Restaurant, 2237 Grace Hurry Avenue, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 30, Division 17, The Igloo, in 2223 Grace Hurry Avenue. Relocated to Birchwood and Grace Harvey Senior Apartments, 2309 Carpenter Street. Reason being, refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay. Ward 34, Division 4. Divinity Banquet Hall, 6011 Market Street. Relocated to the Barber Shop, 6026 Gallagher Street, Rear. Reason being, refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay. Ward 34, Division 14, Kimball Funeral Home, 1100 North 63rd, 
Rita Cave to Overbrook Elementary School trailer, 2032 North 62nd Street, raising me refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay, Board 30, Division, I'm sorry, Board 34, Division 30, Board 34, Division 31, Overbrook Park Church of Christ, 7630 Woodline Avenue. Relocated to Lamberton School, 7501 Woodbine Avenue, recent being refusal. I vote to approve. 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 Okay. 34, Division 33, Campbell Funeral Home, 1100 North 63rd Street. Relocated to Overbrook Elementary School, trailer, 2032 North 62nd Street. Recent I vote. being refusal. I vote to approve. 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 Okay. 34, Division 36, head to toe salon, 6237 Market Street, relocated to Divinity Banquet Hall, 6011 Market Street, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. 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 Board 35, Division 1, St. Williams Memorial Hall, 6200 Rising Sun Avenue, relocated to Trinity Church of Oxford, Education Building, 6901 Rising Sun Avenue, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Okay. Ward 35, Division 6, Ward 35, Division 7, Ward 35, Division 8, St. William Memorial Hall, 6200 Rising Sun Avenue, relocated to Philadelphia Bible Fellowship, 6312 to 14 Rising Sun Avenue. Reason being refusal. I vote to move Okay. Ward 39, Division 14, Venue Bar and Lounge, 3101 South 13th Street, relocated to Chimney and Pete's Play 2, 1526 Packer Avenue, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay, 39, Division 23, Harvard Recreation Center, 609 Snyder Avenue, relocated to Storefront, 2302 South 7th Street, uh, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay, Board 40, Division 50, Redeemer, Moravian Church, 2950 South 70th, relocated to Hardy Williams Veterans Center, 7100 Brokers Avenue, reason being re refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay, Board 43, Division 8, Board 43, Division 19, Lent Fest Center, 3890 North 10th, Relocated to Cayuga School, 4344 North 5th Street, reason being refusal. Vote to approve. Approve. Okay, Ward 43, Division 21. Ward 43, Division 24. Lent Fest Center, 3890 North 10th. Relocated to PGW Building, Broad and Geary. That would be 1337 West Geary Avenue. Reason being refusal. Vote to approve. Approve. Okay, Ward 3043, Division 25, Lent Fest Center, 3890 North 10th, relocated to Hunting Park Recreation Center, 1101 West Hunting Park Avenue, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 47, Division 10, Gesu School, 1700 West Thompson Street, relocated to Beckett Gardens Community Center, 1410 North 16th Street, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 49, Division 8, Oakland Presbyterian Church, 6637 North 11th Street, relocated to PASSI Evergreen Center, 6926 Old Europe Road, reason B, refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay, Ward 50, Division 14, Ward 50, Division 15. Reformation Lutheran Church, 1215 East Vernon Road, relocated to FS Edmond School, 8025 Florida Avenue. Reason being refused. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 50, Division 29, Enon Tabernacle Baptist Church, East 2800 West Chelsea Avenue, relocated to El Sadai Christian Assembly, 1448 Greenwood Avenue. Reason being refused. I vote to approve. 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 5102, Ward 5102 and 5107, King Sessing Library, 
1201 South 51st Street, relocated to Mastery Marty Williams Charter School, 5400 Warrington Avenue, reason being refusal. 5105, Ward 51, Division 5, sorry about that, King Sessing Library, 1201 South 51st Street, relocated to Pomegi School, 5100 Greenway Avenue, reason being refusal. Okay, Joyce, we're just going to ask you to hold up for a second. Sure. Um, we're going to have to uh, call a recess for a minute to just take care of some uh, board business, and we'll be we'll be right back. That's Ward 51, Division 7, which was moving from, proposed to be moved from King Sessing to Mastery Harvey Williams Charter School. Uh, yes, I did that when I did 5102, I combined. Okay, I oh, that my apologies. That's okay. 50, Ward 51, Division 7, um, King Sessing Library, 1201 South 51st Street, being relocated to Mastery Harvey Williams Charter School, 5400 Warrington Avenue. It's under construction. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Okay. So now we'll move to 50, 452 Division 6, the Duffield House. Okay. And 52 Division 7, Duffield House. Uh, relocating to Bridge Shalom House, 3939 Pontiac Avenue. But that's going back to the original site. I vote, Duffield House. I vote to approve. Approve. Uh, Ward 52, Division 9, Charter Baptist Church, 3955, on Chapman Avenue. That is staying there, going back to the original site, which is Charter Baptist Church. So, 529 is was at the Charter Baptist Church, and it's moving to Simpson House. Yes. That's back to the, yes, 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 Commissioner, it's going back to its original site. And Simpson House is its original site. Yes. I vote to approve. Approve. Proceed. Okay. Ward 52, Division 28, Sharon Baptist Church, 3955 Conchhopkin Avenue. Relocated to Bridge Shalom House, 3939 Conchhopkin Avenue. Back to its original site. I vote to approve. 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 Okay. 
456, Division 33, First Church of the Nazarene, 1707, Shellmeyer Avenue, relocated to Northeast High School, 1601 Cotton Avenue, recently refusing. I vote to approve. 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 Ward 62, Division 7. Ward 62, Division 10. Ward 62, Division 11. Regal Bull Group, 5411 Oxford Avenue. Relocating to Knights of Columbus, Council 4935, 5323 Oxford Avenue. Reason being, refusing. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 62, Division 12. Ward 62, Division 14, Regal Bowl Group, 5411 Oxford Avenue, relocating to Ziegler School Gym, 5935 Soul Street, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 64, Division 2, Park Terrace Apartments, Community Room, 8040 Roland Avenue, relocating to Lambie Funeral Home, 8000 Roland Avenue, reason being refusal. I vote to approve. 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 Ward 65, Division 18, storefront at 7755 to 59 Frankfurt Avenue, relocating to Millsburg Recreation Center, 4500 Bone Street. Reason B, refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Ward 65, Division 19, Ward 65, Division 21, storefront at 7755 Frankfurt Avenue to 59 Frankfurt Avenue, relocated to Holmesburg Youth Club at 7756 Dippin Street. Reason being, refusal. I vote to approve. Approve. Okay. Last one is Ward 66, Division 46, Catherine Drexel Library, 11099 Lakes Road. Uh, relocated to Benjamin Rush High School, 11081 Lakes Road. Reason being, refusal. By request, sorry about that. I vote to approve. Approve. And that's it. Thank you, Jesus. You're welcome. Any, any more new business? I have none. <coughs> I would just like to say thank you, General uh, Joyce, everybody on the staff. Look at that. I would just like to echo that. Uh, looks like a mountain work in a home place unit. Uh, so we appreciate appreciate your hard work and especially all the work that's uh, being done with the gals and we're almost there. So thank you all as always for your professionalism and your work. If there's no more further new business, no more old business, I make a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. Move. This meeting is adjourned to the call of the chair. Have a great and beautiful day everyone. It's lovely out. You too.